All right. This is problem. You see the clown here? Ah, uh, ah, uh, Lynn Williams. Lion of Judah. That's it, Paige. You lion of Ju lion of Judah? Hebrew? And you talking like this? All right, you're right, Hebrew is alike. You're talking like this? If all sinners will die and go to hell, as some preachers say, then I guess the whole world would be there because the Bible said, if we say we have no sin, we deceive ourselves and the truth not in us. Look at, look at that fool trying to be smart. All right, go to the very next verse, verse 9. It says, we confess our sin. He prayed us to forgive us our sin that declares us from all unrighteousness. Now I want to invite your attention to the book of Revelation, chapter 20. I want I want to keep keep this here. Revelation chapter 20. Matter of fact, let me do this. All right. Revelation chapter 20 in verse 7. It says that when the thousand years are expired, Satan, Satan shall be loose out of his prison and shall go out and deceive the nations, which are the four in the four corners of the earth, God made God together, them together, to bow the number of them is as the sand of the sea. And they went up on the breadth of the earth that could pass the count of the saints about the beloved city. And fire came down from God out of heaven and devoured them. And the devil that deceived them were cast into the lake of fire and brimstone, where the beast and the false prophet are. And he shall be tormented day and night forever. Verse 11, 20 chapter of Revelation. Watch this. Verse 13. Well, let's let it go. 11. And I saw the great white throne of him and him that sat on it, from whom faith the earth in heaven cleared away, and that was found no place with him. And I saw the dead, verse 12, small and great, stand before God. And the book was open, and another book was open, which is the book of life. And the dead were judged out of those things which were written in the books, according to their works. And the sea gave up the dead, verse 13, which were in it, and uh, death. And, and the sea gave up the dead, which were in it. And death and hell delivered, death and hell delivered up the dead which were in them. And they were judged, amen, according to their works. And death and hell were cast into the lake of fire. This is the second death, the second death, the second death. Whosoever was not found written in the book of life was cast into the lake of fire. Okay, who is that? In the 21st chapter of Revelation, verse 8, but the fearful, unbelieving, abominable, murderer, whoremonger, sorcerers, idolaters, and all lies shall have, all, shall have their part in the lake of fire and brimstone, which is the second death. You see, you see, you're going to be in second death. The lake of fire breath on second death. All right, the Bible says the way of sin is death. All right, God said, all soul of mine, but the soul that sin is shall die. Uh huh. Jesus said, fear not man that can kill the body, but rather fear him that can destroy both soul and body in hell. Uh huh. Jesus said, go and preach the gospel to every creature here, believe in him, baptize every say here, believe not, shall be damned. All right. God said, so love the word that he gave his only begotten son, who's well believing him should not perish, but have whatever that is in life. The second death is the lake of fire and brimstone. All right. Galatians chapter 5, verse 19, give you a whole list of some of the sins you are doing. Corinthians 6 and 9, give a list of some of the sins you are doing. You say, you ain't going to heaven. All right. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Ah, uh, now, let's keep working. 
All that right there is said. Well, I don't do this, but you do that. All that right there is said. Now go back to 1 John 1 and 9, what this clown didn't go to. Jesus Christ, the Son of God, will clear you from all your sin. If you want to be saved, if you confess your sin to him, repair your sin, believe him, but take away your sin, his blood for the mission of sin, he'll take away all your sin. Thank you, but really, now you know. Look, it did right here. Don't, don't you don't you know the every scripture you pull to prove that it's okay to sin? Don't you know you condemn your own self? How about you get the scripture where Jesus take away your sin? Where Jesus clear you from sin? Where he tell you don't sin? How about you get that scripture? Thou fool. 